pests and insects are part of nature. But when left unchecked, they can be any farmer's worst nightmare. The trick is to have a good balance. Now, when it comes to spray programs and products, responsible use leads to sustainable solutions. I'm gonna to talk to Tyrone from Syngenta and we're gonna be talking about spray programs. Tyrone, thanks for coming through. Thank you for having me, Toby. So Tyrone, let's start with your relationship with Joel. Tell me more about this. Well, Toby, I've met uh, Joel around five years ago where he um, came to our Lafeld Agrichem depot um, and he asked me to uh, kindly come and advise him on his farm about how to choose the right pesticides and in order to get the best work from them. So that's when we came here and we looked at the techniques on the farm and we decided that there are some techniques that can be improved like planting techniques and spraying techniques. Um, and that's where we started. So it sounds like you and Joel have quite a bit of a journey. So I would like to know the work you do with Syngenta. How do you guys go out and advise farmers and give them proper products tailored specific to their needs? Well, Toby, it's, it's good that you say tailored because each and every individual area has its own microclimate, basically. And you need to tailor a spray program towards that climate because life cycles of insects might be shorter or longer in each and every individual climate. So that's where we tailor a specific spray program towards your techniques, towards your climate and to your procedures that you do on your farm. Now, it is important for every farmer to have the correct products with the correct spray program. But at the same time, we all wanna make money, but we have also the environment to think about, right? That's correct, Toby. So why is it important that farmers use these products responsibly? Well, Toby, like I said, um, there's different life cycles of insects. And if you spray something over and over on a specific insect, it might be that they start developing a resistance towards the insects. And that's when you have to have a look at your spray program. You have to tailor the spray program towards the life cycles and make sure that you have enough intervals and enough products throughout the spray program that will help you to not uh, create resistance. And also farm sustainably. And also farm sustainably, yes. Thank you so much, Tyrone, for that. Thank you so much, Toby.